Hey guys, it's Karina with Karina Loves to Plan. Welcome back to my channel. So it is back to work on, well, what day is it? The 4th of January. So I am going to be doing four plan with me's in my Happy Planner Classic Daily Pages. And I thought, because I'm in absolute love with this sticker book, I'm going to do four different daily spreads with this Flower Power Mega sticker book. And I will choose four different themes because there's so many in here that are just so gorgeous. So I thought, why not use one of my favorite sticker books right now and use it as much as possible. All right, let's get started. So there's so many different florals in here that are absolutely amazing. Do these go with those? Oh my god, I think they do, and I totally didn't use them. Ooh, okay. All right. Stay. I'm going to use these because I absolutely love them, and they're just gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. So, and I could still use plenty of them in my memory planner. So let's use yellow. Now this will be slightly more difficult to take a photo of, but that's okay. I always cover up that part because I don't need it for work. And then down here, I do use a couple of bigger boxes. Those are fantastic. Uh, how do I want to use them? I'm gonna take one big one and just place it like so. Then take this I feel like I could put a couple here. Just want to make sure that it's straight because you guys know me I'm not very good with putting things down straight. Maybe. Oh. I don't know what to put on this side. Maybe another. normally I put like a to-do list in here and then in here go my actual meeting schedule and then these are any notes that I take during the day. So let's, yeah, this whiteout doesn't work well on a slightly soft surface. So I'm going to put some small flowers there, not this one, I'm saving that for my memory planner. a yellow here now I don't have any like there's these labels which are fine but I don't think they would work too too well although I feel like I could use some of this and some of this There we go. And actually with that down, I'm not going to label these. Because I know, like I, go, I do my priorities here. So these are the things that I, I mean along with my to-do list, these are the top three things that I have to make sure are done on a day-to-day -day basis. And again, my notes over here. Already, I love it. And mix with that, I feel like I need to add some of the black and white florals up at the top just to give it some, again, balance. I'm not going to do this one. And there, so that there's a mix of the colors. And then I'll add another couple little florals down here to, again, balance out the colors.
Oh my God, you guys, I love that. And that came together so, so quickly. All right, so that is plan with me number one. Plan with me number two. I feel like I just need to go in and choose. So, oh, those are pretty. These ones. Maybe let's switch this around so that you guys can actually see the stickers as well as the page. Perfect. It's going to be awkward for me because I don't normally like plan like that. Oh my God, they're so pretty. Okay. Pick one, be brave, life takes time, go after your dreams, shine. I feel like whatever sticker you pick is like the main one, kind of goes with like your uh, Enneagram. And I, I'm in a three wing two. So, I don't know, wanting to shine might be very me. Oh my God. How gorgeous. Okay, this one big one is going right here and that's my to-do list. Holy cow. Like how beautiful is that? Then, like I can't even. Actually like these for the bottom and that's gonna go a bit off the page there then it actually does look a little awkward that it's off like that so I might add uh, does that look weird nah then dark ones are amazing. I'm gonna see if they have, yes they do. I'm doing something very similar that I did in the last spread. Using these as, I mean, they could be checklists, but I use them as like little washi strips so not straight that's okay and then I'm gonna put these ones back because maybe I want to use three different ones for this like this with this they're not straight but you know what part of me really doesn't care and then this over priorities Gosh, and then go in with some more florals. So I'm kind of disappointed that I use that one because it's not as dark as the other ones. Like this is just the blue. It's insanely gorgeous. And then adding a little bit of the purple here. again meeting schedule goes here and then my notes and then my to-do list here gosh I love that I don't even want to add any more to that because it is gorgeous I love these plan with me's because they're so so quick so that's plan with me number two plan with me number three is going to use these beautiful florals these were from a sticker book that I couldn't get here in Canada and I love them well which ones do they go with with those okay oh wow okay cute 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 I love this one so you guys can see that I have the places that I like to put stickers down and that for me makes planning so much easier it's knowing exactly where I like to put the stickers Although I do try to mix it up a little bit when it comes to the actual boxes. 
because I know that there isn't a big enough box to go in this area. I'm going to make use of that. Gorgeous. And then layering them like so. And then I'm going to add a floral in that corner because it's just too beautiful. Actually, blue. And this. Or, mm, yeah, blue. Oh my goodness, cute, cute, cute. Then, hmm, lay this out, lay this out. Then I will try and use the boxes in this one because they're gorgeous. And I think what I'll probably do is do different colors to go with the boxes. So we'll do pink up here. Turn it a bit so I don't... And then blue over here. I'm going to put the orange with the blue because that looks so pretty. Then the box, blue with the pink, and then the orange. <gasps> oh, sorry, pink with the orange, duh. I was like, I'm, they're not matching up the way I want to. Okay, then lastly, I need a big floral in this corner, which is gonna come from here. How? Lovely. Now, which one? Mm. Mm. <gasps> oh no, oh no, no, no. Oh crap. Okay. I'm gonna. It's gonna work. It's still gonna work. Darn it. It's just. That's a sign. Just put it down, Karina. Oh, it still looks pretty. I love it. What do you guys think? Like that was one of the, again, these are all so quick and they're just so, so pretty. I love them. All right, so one last plan with me to go. The last plan will be, plan with me will be with this one here. I just, feels like, this one feels so classic. Like this is from, I can believe the first color story sticker book and I always loved this combination. And I will do something very similar to what I did in the last spread, which is taking one of these boxes. And I will actually lay it down like this in the corner. And then use the dark one to go over it like this. So definitely a different way of layering the stickers and you can still kind of see through it but still pretty oh my gosh these all of these florals are gorgeous 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 that's so what charlie said to me that like this sticker book was like made for me yes yes it was i feel like that i completely agree with that statement and i'm gonna add another one here And I will add, just to be different, just like a little strip like that, with a little strip like that. There's something about layering washi, like who is walking up around out there? There's something about layering washi like this that I really, really enjoy. I'm gonna here 
mix them up. So like some will have a washi, one will have a box, nice blue, and then just be a floral. Oops. Pretty. And then I will, they don't really have tiny, tiny florals. I wish they did. I love teeny, tiny florals. But I will take a couple of these and put them around the spread. Actually, I'm gonna leave that as is. All right, so that is the fourth plan with me. So that is it for me. Thank you guys so much for watching. I loved using just the Mega Flower Power sticker book and getting four completely different looking spreads. Even though I'm placing the stickers in about the same area on each page, it still looks absolutely different and this is why I love this process. All right, but that is it for me. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. If you like this video, please leave me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching and have a great day.